Now, Storm Team 2 meteorologist Cameron Saliga with the Miami Valley Certified Most Accurate Forecast. Well, as we head into the morning hour, seeing a lot of fog out there as uh, we get into the end of the six o'clock hour here. We did see that rainfall mainly yesterday into the evening hours before I went to bed. I saw uh, saw the pavement was wet outside and we didn't pick much up after the midnight hour. You see just uh, two one hundredths of an inch there at the National Weather Service in Wilmington as we went past the midnight hour, but we did see right around uh, five one hundredths of an inch in some areas right before the midnight hour. So not much rainfall here yesterday, but it definitely was enough to put down some uh, wet pavement and as well as create some fog here as that system did pass. You can see in the Goodwill Auto Auction camera, barely seen in front of you. Visibility for most, most of us is under a mile, even a lot of us under a half a mile. So give yourself a little extra time on the roadways as you head out if you have to be out in the morning hours. Temperature so currently 42 degrees. The humidity again at 100% as we do have that fog here into the morning hours. Temperatures today hitting the 40s at, or continuing the 40s for us here in Dayton as we go through the morning hours and getting into the noon hour. We'll still see those cloudy conditions eventually hitting the 50s in the afternoon and clearing some of the skies up before that sun does go down. Now as we go through the uh, daytime planner here, we see those temperatures again getting up to 54 and we'll have also the uh, sun full or, or the sun peeking out of those clouds as we go in the afternoon. Live Doppler 2 HD, we're all quiet getting into 647 AM. Zooming on out, we still do have cloud cover. You see the rain now off to the east, but we do have that cloud cover remaining as we go into the morning hours. Also, we do have the fog that's on satellite radar that you can see there as well. Looking at your temperatures right now, we are uh, talking about 40 degree temperatures into most of the middle of the Miami Valley, 44 there in Springboro, 30s into Wapkaneta, Urbana, and as well, Richmond at 37 degrees. Going through the uh, next couple of days here as we head into our next weather maker, we're going to start off as we go into the nighttime tonight. We're going to see uh, some cloud cover present as we get into the nighttime, partly cloudy skies indeed. But uh, as we go in the day tomorrow, you see by the afternoon hours, lots of sunshine here. Not talking about any rain as we end the or end the weekend off. And as well, we do have temperatures that will be in the 60s here as we end the weekend off. Going into the work week, though, Monday should be a dry one going into the night. That's where things become uh, iffy. We could see chances of showers going into Monday night, heading into Tuesday as well. We'll see that cold front approach here into the Miami Valley by the evening hours. We'll see that chance of rain and uh, as we get into the overnight hours, we'll continue to see that chance as well. 54 is your high today, mostly cloudy to partly cloudy, warmer than what we saw yesterday as yesterday was pretty seasonable with temperatures right on the average. 38 for the low tonight, partly cloudy. We have winds up to eight miles per hour, then 66 tomorrow. Get out if you can and enjoy the beautiful weather that we have on tap. Monday, even better, 72 degrees, but that's when things come to an end as that Cold front does approach. We'll see those chances of showers, or ch chances of showers increasing going into Tuesday, and that chance does continue into the middle of the week. Not great chances, but there is a small chance here as we head into next week into the middle of the week with that cool down temperatures in the 50s.